Hi everyone and welcome to my place. It's the fall, it's nearly Thanksgiving, it's Halloween. The nature is changing all the colors to these beautiful golden umbery browns and golds. And I just thought, let me just show you a design that you can do now that will take you almost all the way through to celebrating Christmas. So easy. I have this earthenware jug. It's one of my favorites at the moment. And all I'm going to do is to get some fruit. You can get some fruit branches. This was off my pear tree, or you might have some plum. If you don't have any of that, you might have some twisty willow. And by putting this into the container, what I want to do is to just have like a really good network of forms in amongst my container so that when I put things into it, it'll all hold together. Just shove it in, because it's like, that's the wonderful thing about designing at this time of the year with the fall foliages and flowers. They're sort of rustic and they're quite rough and ready and you can just go whichever way you like with your designing. Now, because it is fall, I've got these lovely branches here. How fabulous are these? So I'm just gonna put one out one side. And you know, you can make a design bigger and bigger and bigger just by putting in like lots of lovely textural quality. Aha, I love these. Prince of Wales feathers, or as we call them here in New Zealand, they're called toy toy. Now I'm not cutting them. If you come to a situation when you're doing your designing and they're too long, don't worry about that. You can cut them if you want to, but I've got a wee saying, once you cut, you can never go back. So if you can bend it up, just bend it up at this stage, because you don't know, you might want to just be using it for something else. So I'm just gonna have those over to that side there. Oh yeah, that's looking good. Right, look at this. This is new to the collection at Prestige Botanicals. These rose hips are divine. I love them. Now they come, let me just show you. Let me just show you. They come seriously, seriously, seriously super long. And while I have you, if you are at all concerned about cutting, let me just show you how easy it is. Just get some really good wire cutters just like that and it's off because I know that I won't be using anything this long in my designing. It's just too big. That can just go down and, and oh, look at that. Look at the berries. It's a beautiful time of the year. Now, I have oh, the Proteas are new to the collection as well and I absolutely love them. I love this little mink one and this the um, King Protea is also equally beautiful. The leaves and the textures are absolutely an amazing, amazing flower to be using. I use them all year round. So with that, I'm just going to push, and I'm not going to cut this. I'm just gonna put that over and into there, and I'm gonna bring that one down and into there. The next thing I've got are these, oh, look at these dahlias. Oh, these two are equally long, but I do have a design that I'm going to use these for in due course, so I'm not going to cut them. Now I need to turn this around so that I can see which way I'm going. And I'm just gonna bring that down into there, and I'll bring oh, this one here, up into there, like so. And I'll bring those out like that. Oh, it's very difficult when I do these big berthas and I often get told off for doing it, but you know, it's okay. Now, I'm going to use another one of these, which I'm just going to push in to there like so and pull that out. And then with these cones, I'm gonna show you in a minute where I'm going. With the cones, I'm just going to put those in and around to the base of my design because as I said, I wanted something that, oh, that was informal. So that can go into there, lifting that up there and then bringing that gorgeous big hydrangea down into there. And so I'm a bit rough and everywhere today, but never mind. I just wanted to demonstrate that you can be rough and ready with your designs when you are working with these beautiful forms. Look at that. Oh, that's moving. Hold on, hold on. It's not quite as good as I wanted, but let me turn it around and I will have a wee sort out so that it does look a little bit better in due course. So there we have lovely, quick and easy 
designing for four. Just be loose. Thank you.